this spring break edition of the Wizard Weekly News. I'm your host, Paris Condor. And I'm Keegan Cunningham. Thanks for joining us. In Paris, can you feel it? Spring break is only a few short hours away. The dates of spring break are April 1st through April 5th. But wait, that's only five days. Why is our spring break so short? Is this because of the construction again? April 1st through uh, the 5th are the actual days we will not have school. The weekends are not added into that. If you count weekends, then we actually have nine days without having to come to school. What? In other news, all you juniors, listen up. The day we come back, that's right, the day we come back from spring break, juniors will be taking the SAT test that morning. This is, the, this is only the, one of the most important moments of your life. Whoa, slow down there, big shooter. I don't know if we need to add any more pressure to these poor kids or myself. Yeah, you're right. Just don't expect to go to college if you score poorly, unless your parents are rich, of course. Here's Mr. Marino with more on SAT testing day and the schedule for that day. Um, so in the morning, um, yeah, so the morning of that of April 9th, the right. juniors will come in. Uh, testing will begin right at 8, okay. so students should be here by 7.45, usually at the earliest. Okay. We'll get everything set up. The quicker they're in the rooms, the quicker we can get testing started. The test itself, it, I believe, is three and a half hours worth of testing, uh, four sections, so they'll be here all morning testing. And then in the afternoon, it'll be all ELO. Okay. Um, and so that's when uh, teachers can, our students can come in and talk to the teachers about everything that's going on. So all students can come in, but there's no class in the afternoon that day. Not only is it SAT testing week when we come back, but prom is April 13th, which is the Saturday when we come back. The theme for this year's prom is the Enchanted Garden and will be held at the ranch, which is located at the Budweiser Event Center uh, starting at 8 p.m. After prom is at the summit from 11 p.m. to 2.30 a.m. Tickets are on sale now in the lunchroom for $25. They will bump up to $30 on the day of prom, so buy your tickets now. Okay, so the theme was kind of came up with by uh, Holly Maddox, Tavi Johnson, and Skylar Wagner. They decided that they wanted to do something kind of foresty, kind of magical. So they sat on Enchanted Garden, which I thought was a great idea. Uh -huh. So we ran with that. And if they want tickets, go to the concession stand by the auditorium on your way out towards the parking lot, and they'll be right there waiting to buy, to give you tickets. When we come back, stick around to find out what Wizard Nation is doing for spring break. What's <laughs> up, kids? Uh, prom's coming up, and I've been told that I'm supposed to tell you some rules for that. So uh, come with me, and we'll, we'll check those out. Oh, hey guys. Well, first off, prom is at the uh, McKee 4-H building at the ranch. You know, it's uh, next to Budweiser Event Center. Prom starts at 8 p.m. and royalties announced at 9.30. It goes till 11 p.m., then there's after prom, but you'll figure all that one out. So, if you leave, though, in the middle of prom, there'll be no readmittance. So, like, you know, don't, because it's going to be a good time. And once you arrive, feel free to get comfortable, but not too comfortable. We're not responsible for any lost items, so you lose your phone, lose your shoes, whatever, dude. Hey, have you seen my phone? I think I lost it. That's not really our problem. Oh, hey guys. Just remember, uh, if you want to get into prom, you need a current ID. You can't just come and be like, yeah, I'm Joe. Now don't slide there. One ticket to prom, please. Easy turbo. I'm going to need to see some identification. Here you go. Name? Uh, because this is scribbled real person. I'm afraid I cannot accept this identification. It appears to be tampered with. Come on, man. You're, uh, uh, harshing my vibe. I'm really sorry to have to say this, but I'm going to have to ask you to please come back with a valid identification. Sorry, pal. Now listen, if you do come to prom, bring your real ID. And if you're from another school, turn in your application by April 10th to Mr. Cofer. And here is the last rule, which I shouldn't even have to say, guys. No drugs or alcohol before, during, or after prom. If you're caught doing it, you'll get kicked out. You know, obviously. Now that's out of the way, we can have some fun at prom. I'll see you guys there. Welcome back. Keegan, what are you doing? Oh, uh, I was just calculating how many seconds were left until spring break. It's about 9.45 right now, and we get out at 3.14, uh, so that means there are only 
32,400 seconds left until spring break. I'll start counting down now. 32,400, 32,399, 32,000. Okay, anyway, we are curious as to what the Wizard Nation would be doing for spring break. So we sent our Wizard Weekly News camera out to see what you are doing for spring break. We're going to go up to Estes Park for a few days, and besides that, we're just hanging out. What I plan on doing on spring break is probably hanging out with my friends or staying home, really. Nothing. We're going to a Jack and Jack concert together. Um, I'm going to Florida. I'm going to Montana. What are you doing for spring break? Uh, nothing. I'm not doing anything either. I am going to be going up to Steamboat because my grandparents own a house up there. I'm planning on taking driver's ed and getting my permit. What are you doing for spring break? Pretty much all I'm going to be doing is sleeping and working. Taking my sexy boy Kylie Ann Anderson to California with me. We hope you all have a very safe and enjoyable spring break. Thanks for joining us this week. We will see you in two weeks.